it looks like we're in the middle of nowhere, it's because we are. This is the Saharan Desert Morocco, one of the toughest environments on the planet. We're here to take a spin on a mode of transport that is loved around the world and has remained more or less unchanged for years. And despite its off-road capabilities, it's usually kept on a short leash where families take their belongings from A to B and go around their daily business. However, a new generation rooted in a deep sense of luxury is here to change that. But we've come to Morocco to see exactly how well it performs when let loose out in the wild. Of course, we're not talking about camels. We're talking about the all new Volkswagen Touareg. Let's jump in and go for a spin. We've signed up to a Volkswagen customer experience drive so we can see the sights and go on a bit of adventure along the way. Because what better proving ground than a road trip through the country where this SUV gets its name? The all new Volkswagen Touareg. Reborn, reimagined and redesigned from the ground up. So forget everything you thought you knew about this car. This is a third generation Touareg. It's bigger, more luxurious and more technologically advanced than its predecessor and it's coming right for the Audi Q7, BMW X5 and Volvo XC90. VW is confident that it has the performance to back it up as well, so that's why we're here. Five days, multiple cities and a melting pot of terrains, just to see if the German giant could put its money where its mouth is. Our first stop, the largest sand dunes in the Sahara. Well, they weren't kidding about the sand dunes. Welcome to Egg Shabi, where what goes up must come down. <laughs> Here we go. Pointing an almost two-ton SUV down a 30-degree gradient is terrifying, but it helps that our cars are specced with the off-road pack that includes a sand mode. Touareg 1, Morocco 0. After a day of desert driving out in those enormous sand dunes near the border of Morocco and Algeria, we've arrived in this town which is full of Berber people, camels, and this very cool low-lying desert architecture. And as you can see, the terrain has changed yet again. Inside this five-seater is where it really does shine. The level of elegance, futurism, and creature comfort going on in this cabin puts it up against SUVs that are significantly more expensive. Just when we thought all the fun stuff was over, we have one more mini adventure in store, and that is to take on the riverbed down there. Now, the river is unusually large because there's been quite a lot of water in the past few weeks here in Morocco, but of course, that should just make for more fun. But first, we're gonna check out the ancient city of Aïd Ben Adou, which dates back between the 12th and 16th century. So, let's go. It's safe to say that the muddy riverbeds of Wazazet are totally alien to the average suburban Tuareg, but sailing over these rocks has been too much fun. Next, we're back on bitumen, ready to take on the twisty mountain roads to Marrakesh. How amazing is this? We're in the shadow of the snow-capped Atlas Mountains in the Dardes Valley. And this is just another example of the ever-changing landscape of Morocco. And what we're learning out here in the middle of the Sahara is that with literally every terrain, sand, dirt, rocks, gravel, mud, snow, riverbeds, water, hill climbs, is that the new generation Tuareg really sings. This thing not only has had a sexy and stylish makeover, but the new Tuareg has totally got its groove back. After everything we've thrown at it, this SUV certainly has an unexpected appetite for exploring off the beaten track. Though all this luxury and technology will come at a price, which might put off some buyers. But if this is what it can do out here, imagine what it can do back home. The Tuareg is an awesome option for those who want to adventure in style. Well, it's been a wild ride, but we are back in Marrakesh. The cars are covered in dust, we are covered in dust, and the Sahara has certainly proven itself as a worthy testing ground for the all-new Volkswagen Touareg. Now, not only did the desert really show off this stunning new SUV's capabilities, but it really did test us as drivers. And the cool thing about what you saw us do out there this week is that all of that is typical of a Volkswagen customer experience program. 
which means you can sign up for pretty much the same thing if you dare. For information on this and more exciting drive days with other car brands, head to whichcar.com.au forward slash drive days.